Writing articles just got faster with papers. You can add citations and entire bibliographies to your work in any application, but we'll first get you started citing in pages. When you are working on a manuscript, you can easily search your paper's library and enter a reference. Hit the control key twice, and a small papers dialog box will open up, regardless of whether you have papers running in the background or not. Type in your search command and identify the paper you would like to cite. Hit enter and you can select insert citation. Papers generates a unique cite key which is inserted into your document. Let's enter some more citations and let's say this time we would like to add more than one reference at a time. We can do this in just one step. After you find the first paper you want to cite, either continue typing to find the next one or click on search another paper. The first paper you found is still there. Papers just has it on hold for now until you're finished finding all the references you would like to add at this point in your manuscript. Once you click on Insert Citations, Papers will add all the references you selected at this instance, each one with their own unique cite key. Let's add one more citation before we format our manuscript and add the bibliography. Use the control key twice again to pull up the citations menu from where you can format your paper and add your bibliography. Before formatting your manuscript, ensure you select the citation style you would like to use. Papers can format your work in almost 3000 different citation styles. Type in a journal name to find a citation style you would like to use. Hit enter and you'll see your manuscript being formatted in real time using the citation style you chose. When finished, you will notice an entirely new document has opened up. It has the same name as your original, just has formatted added to the end of it. This is your finished formatted document with your bibliography. If you want to make more changes or edit your document, you will have to do that in your original and reformat it again. Luckily with papers, this isn't a whole lot of work. The reason for it is that in pages, all the information contained within site keys is replaced with just text. Any text that is contained within the formatted document, papers no longer recognizes as being a site key. That's it for your quick tour. Enjoy citing with papers.